Hey y'all, it's me Nisha coming to y'all a video today. And today is a what's in my bag on this little cutie right here. This right here, you guys, is my canteen bag by Carlos Santana. Yep, you heard me correctly. I said Carlos Santana. I remember he made bags a while ago. I don't know if they're still being made, but I do know you can find them on like Poshmark and um, what's the other one? Macari probably ebay as well but this one i purchased right before the lockdown the very first lockdown it was either right before or at the the very beginning of the lockdown when it was like oh only essential you could be outside and all of that so yeah i bought this bag right during that time so i've had it for a couple of years and i really pulled this one out more so when i just have on a dress and i want to be hands free i don't really want a bag on my arm or you know crossbody this thing and I'd be good to go. So I love this bag because of its size. A lot of y'all gonna look at this bag and be like, God, dog, that's a big old canteen bag. And, and it is, mm -hmm. it sure is. And I love it. I love the size of this bag. Um, it is, I believe eight by eight by two. So I see the, the canteen bag on coach website and it's so stinking cute. And I went and looked at the dimensions. I was like, it ain't gonna work. It's a no for me. Like the size, it's just a little bit too small. I kind of feel that way about the heart bag too. I think it's really cute, but me and a small bag like that, it's just not gonna work. Cause I need to be able to get it and move stuff around and not be like aggravated by the bag. So this bag gives me great space and I can add to this bag. So I'm just gonna stop talking and go ahead and get on into it. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get on into it. So it does have a nice deep slip pocket in the front my phone can fit in here it only sticks out like probably this much at the top so i love that about this bag um it does have this 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 material on the side that i'm not really a fan of it's some some sort of a reptile um i look past it because the bulk of the bag was i think this is faux leather i don't think this is leather yeah this isn't it isn't leather but it's but it's good like it's holding up it's, it's doing good for me okay um, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it a nice little spin around. There's no pocket in the back. And that's the side. Does have a nice little top handle. This is not the strap. This is one of my coach straps. And y'all, for the life of me, I cannot figure out which bag this came off of because it's a great size. It has a nice drop. I don't know if this is a 23 inch drop or a 24, but this this is a long little, little, little strap and I love it. I just, I don't know which bag it came off of, but I put it on here and I pretty much inter interchanged this one with um my andy crossbody as well so these are the this is the strap that i use for that and this bag so i'm going to go ahead and show y'all the bag um the zipper is two zippers and they go all the way down all the way down and the bag does have a nice little gusset on the side so nothing is going to fall out but you guys you see how wide i can open this bag i freaking love the size of this bag. There's also a nice little slip pocket in the back. But yeah, y'all, I love this bag to pieces. So without further ado, I'm just gonna go ahead and start pulling what I have in this bag. First thing I see is my hand sanitizer that I picked up from the Dollar Tree in the lavender. Yeah, I'll be going to the Dollar Tree and I'll be looking for these because I like the container and I wanna be able to like refill ones and put them in different bags. They ain't in there. What at Dollar Tree? They're not in your store. So I probably need to look online, but yeah, I love this little um, spray hand sanitizer. I also have this little hand lotion in there that is by From Nature. This is in the scent Raspberry. I don't know what I was expecting when I smelled this, but y'all, it smells good. It's, it smells like a little juicy little berry. I just don't recall raspberry smelling this good, but you know, it is what it is. And I picked that up from Marshall's in a nice little kit. So I like this one. Um, the white musk one is my favorite and something else came in there. I think it's so, it's a citrus, a citrus one. I also have this here um, healing ointment, the Dollar Tree, not Dollar Tree. What is it? Walmart, the Quake brand. <laughs> and it is um, equivalent to the aqua forehand um healing ointment which i have a really big one of that it won't fit in this purse so this is one that i have because it is time i have eczema y'all like listen i need to put on some right now if you catch the wrong angle you're gonna be like golly nisha what was you thinking girl but my my, my business okay my business i'm using <laughs> this little um wallet that i got from target as my card 
holder and wallet for this week. In the back, I just have my most used cards. Um, and here is a receipt from the Dollar Tree. And in the zip part, I am just using it to hold all of my insurance cards and things like that. So I have that, that is my, my nice little slim wallet. I don't even know why I try. Like, look, every time. <laughs> Probably need to put something on this table so everything won't slip and slide. The next thing I have is my little mini composition book from the Dollar Tree. I was so happy when I found these and I have them in three different bags now and I love these to pieces. So I do use mine. Like I know a lot of people ain't really using this, but listen, I, if it's in there, it's gonna get used. I ain't spending my money for nothing, okay? I ain't spending it for nothing. This I got from Amazon. It's a nice little slim little pouch and I love it. Like look at these little hearts. I'm a sucker for a good heart, okay? And I'm just using it as my little bathroom pouch. So in there I have wipes, liners, and some pads. Is anything on the outside? Uh, um, what is that? Lens wipes. Why they in here with this? I don't know. But yes, some lens wipes in there. And I also have some Mentos that I've been snacking on. My AirPods are in here, of course. And I am using my Coach Corner Zip as a medicine pouch this week. And in there, I do have soap sheets. Why that's not in there, I don't know, but it's there, okay? My eye drops. And I also have some tea and Excedrin and also uh, vitamin C in there. Y'all know I, I have to have my goods. I have to have my goods in there. So I have that. And I think that's it. That's it that's in the bottom everything that I had on the inside. So now I'm gonna start pulling what is in the zip pocket. Placards, of course. A little perfume sample by Anitio, Anitio Perfumes in high frequency. Y'all, this smells amazing, like amazing. It smells so good. But let me tell you something, I put this on and it don't have no lasting power. If I'm gonna spend, $365 on a perfume, it best lasts me. Like I better smell it in from the dirty clothes hamper. Okay, like it's, it's <laughs> this not given that. So I have not made any purchases for this um, perfume brand because the ones that I have, the samples that I have, they don't last long. And I'm sorry, if I'm giving you my good heart on money, baby, you best give me good longevity and ain't giving that but it does smell good i wish it did last and i would most definitely get the um the big bottle this is my pen that i have that i'm using y'all know y'all know i gotta have some lip balm it's that time of year honey it you need it and then there's a laffy taffy green apple back there and what else oh i have my domes of course and some zizol Cause I was, I was, I was outside y'all. I was outside for a little bit. I'm back in the house though. But yes, that is everything that is in this bag. It is super cute. And I just have a black pom-pom on there with, I don't know where I got that little thing from that didn't come on it. I don't think, I think I was, did I add that? I believe this came from Shein. Cause you know Shein, I'm telling you about their charms. Their charms be turning. And I don't like that for me. <laughs> I don't like that at all. But yeah, so I have that on there, but this is, one of my favorite bags. I use this bag a lot. So yes, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and get this all set up like I normally do. All right, so here's the final setup of this bag. Y'all, I love this bag to pieces. Like, I know I say that about every one of my bags, but let me tell you something. If you're seeing a bag on my channel, I love it. If I don't love the bag, y'all won't see it. And if I do happen to like unbox it, and then no longer love it, I will be sure to let you know. But honey, if you see seeing what's in my bag on the bag, she loves the bag, Zam. okay? So yes, I am itching to get into my Dempsey 22. I haven't been in that bag because I've been loving on my crossbody bags for a minute now, and I'm ready to get in something a little bit bigger, but not as big as my Smith tote or a city tote, you know, still on the small side, but not too, too big. So be on the lookout for that video. That one will be filmed next and up on my channel. So I don't know if that will be uploaded this weekend or next week. I don't know. It just depends on how I'm feeling after the weekend. I got some stuff going on, y'all. So I don't know. All right. 
So thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, loveies.